Okay, it is O oh, Dark 30 and getting ready to go to Party. So everything has been set up. And we're gonna go over what I did to the trailer and modified it. Pretty neat what I did. Everything's loaded. So on our way to stop in Tennessee. Oh, we'll have a little updates uh, during the uh, drive. Is uh, she gets fascinating, or at least hopefully just boring. So yeah, basically working on the trailer to the last minute yesterday. It was really painful. Oh, uh, uh, this is going to be really cool. Hopefully the weather holds off and we'll uh, go to Mope Party. Oh, it's not a trip unless you stop at Bucky's. And there it is. They even have one of the sandwiches now. Yep, so this has been uh, very uneventful, thank God. And, uh, yeah, we're ready to rock and roll. Almost done. We'll have a big update when I'm halfway. Yes, and of course, at Bucky's, you just gotta love the soda stuff. Look, real sarsaparilla and all these other flavors. Look at this. This is absolutely incredibly great. It's not, definitely not a road trip, but I'll come in the Bucky's. Okay, so it's the end of day one going to Mobile Party. And it's been uh, fascinating. It's it, it's been traffic's been a little heavy, and so I haven't really been able to do any show anything while I was driving because well, safety I guess. But uh, we we actually made it pretty nice. Um, I'm gonna kind of do a little walk around what I've done to this trailer. I was killing myself doing. Uh, and it's and you know the thing is it's not completely done. It's just it's good enough now to get here. So what I've done, and, and comment if you have any suggestions, because I'm always open. So put a nice marine battery in a battery box. I need to put straps on here. Now these are my lights that I've put for uh, tie down. And uh, I have them hooked up in here in a, with a waterproof switch. And they light underneath the car like that, nice and bright. And I have the second ones, and what I'm going to end up doing with that, what I'm going to do with that is I'm going to take these back ones, because like this, see they shine, they shine kind of down, and uh, then you take them, you flip them up, and you can see underneath the car, which is spectacular, because I've had so many times when I've been trying to look underneath the car with a flashlight, you can't see a damn thing. Uh, I'm going to hook them into the backup lights. I put LED uh, marker uh, rears on it. I need to redo all the running lights because they're just, they're just, they're not good. Yeah, the, the running lights are just not good. Yeah, they're all incandescent, bulb, unbright stuff. You put that like that. And uh, yes, I, I put uh, my jack on. This box is going to go. It sucks. I either gonna get a, a truck box like for a Ranger or a C10 or Tacoma across here because it'll be shorter and it'll be out of the way of everything I need because these need to be back here. Um, that needs to be up here. My trailer, the jack needs to be on the side, and all this is in the way. So yeah, and uh, you know, we went and we bought tires. We have a, a D rated tire for uh, spare, but then we have 14, I think they're G rated, 14 ply heavy duty tires on this, so we don't have any issues. And it has brakes on both axles. It's really, it, and it, 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 I like that it is a Charger Custom Series. It's almost fitting, you know, for the charger. But you see, the car sits on there really nice. Really nice. The wheels are on securely on the flat spot. I have it pretty far forward. I probably could even come a little more forward, but it, the weight is just right. Uh, when I'm going down the road, it is absolutely just perfect. There's no wobble. And I have to do some beautification with the, uh, with the wiring. I just noticed that. But all that's going to get beautified when I have time, when it's not 150 degrees outside like it's been. So, yeah, I mean, you know, this end, this is, uh, 
incredibly docile uh, Manchester, uh, Tennessee. This is what Bonnaroo Festival is, and uh, by nine o'clock at night, you won't hear any of these cars. It's amazing. It's kind of chill. And yes, I know the uh, the back is squatting down. I need to get some air shocks. Either that or my my shocks are bad. I don't know. It's supposed to be a tow package, and I try to tow with it, and it squats too much. It's not great. But, yeah, that's what I've done so far in this trailer. And, uh, you know, we've driven um, 600 miles, and it's been uh, not solid. The, the load angle was beautiful. I'll, I'll unload it when I go to the show. I'll unload it. I'll show. It, it's, it's, it's awesome. Let's see, we got our uh, year of make plate on there. Because, why not? So, yeah. And as always, you, know, you can get stickers. Get stickers besides the new shirts that we have. So, yeah, that's... Uh, that's that's the update now from uh, our trip to Mo Party. I can't wait. I, can't, I just hope that the rain holds off because I'm going to do so much better than I did last year. Because I... I have eight cylinders now, not not seven, with with oil being sucked in all through a cylinder. It's uh, yeah, it's cool. So uh, I'll catch you tomorrow because that's definitely what's going to happen. As always, you know, take out your classic car because you're going to make someone's day, maybe even your own. And uh, I'll catch you tomorrow.